Yo. DJ Academics, man. He, uh, y'all call him OVO or whatever, but, hey, he, he says some stuff, uh, about Kendrick Lamar fans. I, I don't know, um, if it was a posed question or if he was just on that type of time and felt like going on a rant. You know, AK is certain people he just don't have the patience for. You know, the Meek Mills, the Freddie Gills, but this time he just unloaded on the uh, Kendrick fans. No diddy. Um, he said some true stuff, though. He said a lot of stuff about, um, you know, how, you know, they look to knock Drake. Which you could, they look to knock Drake at every chance they get. Which you can make the case both fan bases do that. You know what I'm saying? We can't sugarcoat. Um, but he says Drake fans don't do it because they don't have to because they're used to Drake constantly dropping. Um, whereas Kendrick fans, they're not used to them dropping. And, you know, and there was some other stuff he's saying. He's saying number one, could never chase number two. That's why they fans not like that. He was saying some stuff, but I'm, I'm going to let y'all check it out. Going on to move past the moment. He's dropping two songs tonight. He dropped one with Sexy Red. Y'all can't leave the moment. But I know why y'all can't leave the moment. Because your artists don't really show up that often. So the last thing he showed up for, you got to stay there mentally. Drake going double back and handle, homie. It ain't over. Trust. Maybe not on your timeline. Maybe not on your... But it's going to happen. But until then, I guess you guys are going to be trying to convince yourself that Kendrick won a battle by trying to discredit Drake, which all automatically makes me think, even if we were to say Kendrick won the battle, it feels like this war is very one-sided. Because you don't see Drake fans going out their way trying to discredit anything with Kendrick. Why? Because they don't have to. Number one never looks at number two and says, how do I get him out of number two? Number two looks at number one and says, how do I get him from the top? And right now, Kendrick fans, y'all look like the, the fucking dog barking at the moon. Get him to finally not be number one in the eyes of the masses. You know how you get that? You, you do that not by pointing out, oh, there's reference tracks or he's a fraud or, oh, yo, show him where you get your abs from. You know how you do that? You tell your fucking favorite rapper to drop more music. If Kendrick wants to be number one, drop an album continue to drop you said you're the culture the culture is rocking with you right now but you gotta drop you can't you know if your strategy of winning is hoping the other niggas start losing you don't have a strategy at all all right let's keep this shit moving